G'day guys, if you clicked on this video then you're looking for a tool to help you get your kids to sleep in longer. We've got a grow clock, we've had one for both children, we have just set up this one in my son's room, he is 22 months, he's in his own bed, um, and we just found he was waking up early and he had no concept of what the time was. I mean, the kid's time is so abstract. Saying, oh, sleep in a bit longer, what does that mean? but they can really understand his clock has a star at night and it's blue and then in the morning it changes to a sun and it's bright orange and he gets so excited every morning when that happens because that means he can come out of his room. There's a couple of ways you can use it. You can use it as a it's okay to wait clock so you can get your child to stay in bed and try and sleep until that time and then get up. We tend to have it set to seven o'clock when they can come out of their rooms and we'll have brekkie. So that's what works for us. Every family is different and what works for our family and our kids is gonna be different what works for yours, but I just wanted to share our parenting experience in the hope that it may help you in some way. So as part of the bedtime routine, before we read his books in his bed, we turn on the clock so then it comes to a sun and then we say, good night sun, time for bed, time for sleep. And I press the button and the stars come out. And what I do really love about this grow clock is that it has a bit of a star countdown. So I was talking to a friend and she said her son needed a bit of a countdown or otherwise, if he woke up in the middle of the night, he would think, oh, it's gonna change soon. So he'd just wait, he wouldn't try and go back to sleep. Whereas on this one, it has stars around the outside that count down. So if there's six stars up there, it's clear that it's in the middle of the night. Whereas if there's only one star to go, then it won't be long and it'll be seven o'clock. There's lots of different features with different grow clocks and I'm gonna take you to my office. I'm gonna show you three other ones on Amazon. But like I said, we've got the Tommy Tippy grow clock. The feature I do like about this is you can adjust its brightness. So we've adjusted the brightness overnight. It was just too bright, the blue light in the middle of the night. So that's a good feature. There are other ones where you can actually press on them and they will tell you the time. There's completely battery operated ones. There's ones that have like an analog clock on it as well. When you're starting with this, we got this for our daughter when she was over two and it was because she was waking up early. She was ready to start the day, 4.35. If we told her sleep longer, it's not time to get up, then what would happen is that interaction with another person would wake her up even more and then she was never going back to sleep. So by having the clock, we didn't actually have to tell her. She could see the clock, she could see the color and know that she needed to sleep for longer. When we started with the clock, we started slowly. So when she was waking up at like five o'clock, we adjusted it by short increments. I think we started with like 15 minutes. Online even talked about doing five or 10 minutes. Um, and the reason we did that is we wanted to give her success. So we wanted her to wake up at her normal time and be like, yay, I can get up. So that's what we did. So we kept it at the same time for the first time, so five o'clock. And then the next time we changed it 15 minutes and that worked for us. We were tired, we needed to change. The five to 10 minutes was gonna be too slow for us. So we just changed it to 15 minutes and that worked well. And for our family, we're happy for them to play quietly in their rooms until seven o'clock. So some people use it like that. When it changes colors, they can kind of come out of their room in the morning. Um, for others, it's just trying to keep them to sleep. So they've got to try and sleep until it changes color. So you can use it how you'd like to use it. Um, let's go to my office and I'll show you some other ones. First one I wanted to share with you is called Little Hippo. It has 11,000 ratings, um, four and a half stars, and it is the Amazon's choice. And as you can see, there's lots of different nightlight colors. You can adjust the brightness. It even has a feature where you can have it sleeping for a certain color and then optional play. So that's an option. So that's the first one I wanted to share with you. The next one is an okay to wake. Um, and this one is the Amazon's choice. It has feet. So if you tap on its feet, then it'll light up in the middle of the night um, and you can use it as a nightlight. And they use the color green, green to mean go. So that's another option, that's Amazon Choice. And then I mentioned there was one with an analog clock and here is this one. So this is by Play Monster, Teach Me The Time. So this one is a soft yellow in the evening and turns green in the morning. This clock has the interactive um, time teaching game that I was talking about. It's got five adjustable skill levels apparently. This one can really grow with the child. So here it says age three to five that can teach them it's okay to wake and then five to seven, teach them how to tell the time, and then can use just like an alarm clock like mum and dad's. 
So like I said, there are a couple of options I wanted to share with you. I really hope this video was helpful. Do what works for your family. If you've got any questions, leave them down below. Take care. Bye.